Augmentation has become commonplace throughout the developed world. The sheer scale of this disaster has overwhelmed the authorities. Superstorms continue to hammer the region, hampering relief efforts. These are uncertain times. Our future depends upon the choices we make. As populations continue to expand, megacities emerge worldwide. The extreme conditions have led to a vast exodus of displaced residents. WA bases were on high alert this morning. Direct energy air defenses neutralized the attack almost immediately. Protesters and local forces clashed again today, resulting in yet more bloodshed. Make no mistake, this is a new Cold War. We may not always see our enemies, but they are out there. My name is Jacob Hendricks. I'm your new CO. This is Egyptian Minister Saeed, taken hostage by NRC forces two days ago. After the uprisings in Cairo, they may want to make an example of him, punish him. We're not going to let that happen. Just so we're clear, if this goes wrong, you never existed. The NRC are gonna be here soon. We got about one minute to create the mother of all distractions. Tower, I need all traffic diverted from runway 19. Copy that. Diverting traffic to runway 11. Cargo 4019er, we have a fuel fire on runway 19. Divert course for landing to runway 11. Please confirm. Alright, you're up. Okay, hacking module in place. Recalibrating dead system targeting. We got company. Dead, manual override. Please select target. Input confirmed. Targeting parameters accepted. All is good down here. Possible malfunction at your end? Fire. Now! Firing. Dead system engaging target. Firing. Open the door! Shit! Get down! Get this done! Taylor, the version is in play. Bird is down. Confirmed. The sentries are leaving their post to respond to the crash. Proceed to the package. Make the grab before it breaks. Or gets broken. We're on it. See you at the RP. Roger that. While they're busy dealing with the crash, these uniforms should allow us to slip by unnoticed. So long as we don't have to talk to anyone. So keep your mouth shut. Security stations across the way in the tunnels. Once there, we'll be able to pinpoint the minister's exact location. Heads and weapons down. Keep it cool until we make the grab. I'll follow your lead. Just keep your head down.
the security station. Moving to secure. I hear you, Hendrix. Let's do this. Ready when you are. I'll kill the alarms on this floor. Get plugged in and locate the minister. Taylor, scanning for package. Waiting for hit on facial recognition. Other hostages. I thought it was only the minister. And so did I. Poor sons of bitches. The NRC are known for their brutality. Taylor, did you know there were other prisoners? The minister is the only priority. Understood. Check the next feed. Are we just gonna leave them to be tortured? We have our orders. No match. That's him, the minister. He's being moved. We have to find out where they're taking him. Bingo. Match confirmed. Moving to secure. ETA? Two minutes. Two minutes. I'll be timing you. Son of a bitch was never funny. You sound like the voice of experience. Trust me. I am. Cell block ahead. On me. Don't leave me here. I'll take point. You reach observation. You have made it our home. We only did what we have to do. The interrogator has his back to the door. The Two sentries inside. The guards down. You are. On my mark. Three, two, go! We're here to extract you. Do as I say and you'll make it through this. What about Lieutenant Khalil and the others? Sorry, no time. Khalil was a hero of the Cairo uprising. You know that makes him a valuable asset for their propaganda. They will make an example of him. Fuck! All right, let's go! Here, this one. Get the door. I'll cover. I'll cut the poor bastard down. Minister. Khalil. <sighs> Hendrix. Can you fight, Khalil? Always. We'll grab a weapon from the locker room up ahead and reprogram it to match your biometrics. Sounds like they're finally on to us. Let's move! Taylor, package plus one, secure and inbound. 
plus one. Your orders were to extract the minister. His name is Lieutenant Khalil. Sound familiar? Get moving. We'll see you topside. Depot ahead will be heavily guarded. Get ready to go loud. Get in the elevator. It'll take us up to the hangar. Clear out the NRC. We can get topside. Come on. Get to the elevator. If we do, trust me, we're dead if we don't. Drop them! Move forward! Late. Your imaginary watch is fast. Nice to see you, Jacob. You too, John. You look... You look different. Still seeing Rachel? That didn't work out. That's a pity. Mm. Yeah. No blood? Gonna take care of him as good as you did me? That's not funny, man. We still set in our Xville? Charges are set. All right, good to go. Xville in 10. Diaz, you're on babysitting duty. Let's roll. Stay close. Get to the bridge. 
Rich. I'll keep him busy. Ready's got you from here. Ah! Extra is across the bridge up ahead. They'll still be right in our ass. We've set charges all across the base to cover our exit. We detonate as soon as we're across the bridge. No one follows us. Roger that. Accessing building's electrical systems. Heads up, we have multiple hostiles inside the comms room. Killing lights! What? You expect us to fight in the dark? Something like that. Sending tactical feet to your HUD. Remember, they ain't got the night vision. Take it slow. Pick them off. Use your advantage. Tactical feet. Now what? We both have a pin down. Easy, hold the fire is mine. Beetle's got us pinned down! Easy! Hold your fire, he's mine! Taylor! Alpha 2 Wait, team has rejoined for Xville. It comes easy now, doesn't it, Taylor? Extract is a satellite tower. Commandeer vehicle and key to extraction. You didn't answer me, John. Keep up. Secondary route's just ahead. Hear that? You hearing things already? That itchy finger of yours is infecting your ears. Hey, fuck you. Shut up. I hear it too. Listen. Holy shit. Contact! Contact! NRC assault robots moving in. A shitload of them. We need that door open now. Give us some cover fire. Get inside. Go, go, go. Get to the extract. We'll deal with the robots. Taylor, we're in the clear. We can take it from here. Those other hostages we saw, you can get them out. Not a mission priority. It may not be a mission priority, but there's still people, damn it! Or have you changed so much that you've forgotten what that feels like? 
All right, change of plan. Hendricks, your team will escort the minister to the extract. We'll go back and get the hostages. More robots. Yeah, don't worry about them. We're built to handle them. Go on, get out of here. Go! I got the wheel. Get on the turret. It's okay. Calm down. Just relax. 
You're gonna be fine. We got smarter than Achieved our objectives. The man's always gonna be better than machine. Unfortunately, you sustained life-threatening injuries. You're stable, but you got a long way to go. Who are you? It's me, Taylor. I think it's time you woke up, don't you? Downtown Zurich. Hey, still with us? Welcome back. Taylor. Yeah. Do you know what's happening to you? Am I dreaming? Well, let's say you are. Why not just go with it, right? After all, you can always wake up. December 12th, 2054, 7.30 a.m. We're on board a private commuter train headed to the Zurich headquarters of the Coalescence Corporation. Our uh, cargo, prototype for the Winslow Accord Neural Network Initiative. At its core, specialized AI software that's capable of rewriting itself in order to interface with any other system in the world. State-of-the-art stuff back in the day. It'd go on to revolutionize a broad range of military and civilian applications. At least, it would have if the train had reached its destination. At 7.31 a.m., a terrorist group detonated an explosive device on board this train. The incident sent back our robotics program several years. You're here to stop it. This isn't real. It can't be. What is happening to me? Right now? Right now, you're in a medically induced coma being prepped for surgery. You've got a new bit of hardware inside your head. It's called a direct neural interface, or DNI. I've got one, too. That's how I'm able to communicate with you. Your DNI is what connects your mind with your new body and the larger world around you. We're connected. All of this is a simulation inside our minds. And you got a long way to go. Eleven thirty a.m. December 11th, 2054. Zurich security forces receive an anonymous tip giving them the location of a hideout the terrorists are using. Unfortunately, the ZSF underestimated the firepower these assholes were packing. They got caught with their pants down, and they took it hard. Outcome? Train go boom. You remember Diaz? I think so. It's gonna help get you up to speed on some of the cool new shit you can do. Communication, brother. We all gotta be in sync. Yo, Taylor, you're a fucking dick. He didn't hear shit. If I want to talk to you, the DNI transmits on a closed channel. I don't even have to think about it. But, uh, just so you know, if you ever think about calling Taylor a dick for real, brother, he's gonna mess you up worse than those robots. All right, let's go see if you can do this without ending up with Swiss cheese like those poor bastards. Okay, weapon's hot. Wipe the floor with these assholes. Right to the left. There's never just one route. High, low, left, right. Different paths yield different advantages. I can provide 
provide combat critical info to help you better read the battlefield. Switch it to tactical mode, like opening your eyes for the first time, right? Alright, use your enhanced mobility. It may take a little getting used to, but your confidence will soon grow. Try it for yourself. I got a hundred says you can do it. Not bad, newbie. Not bad. Attack mode will highlight inbound threats such as rockets and grenades. You see flashing red? Move. DNI doesn't just help us communicate with each other. It allows us to interact with a variety of computer systems, including pretty much all the basic drone units. Now, bipeds, sophisticated ground units, those are a whole lot trickier, brother. Those sons of bitches got a damn hive mind. You try to process and control all that, your brain is toast. But these? These fuckers are easy. Go ahead. Back in. Let's we'll see what's on the other side of this wall. Fits like a glove, right? Now somewhere through there is a generator. Take it out and that door should open. Also help you kill. There she is. 
Load that generator so we can get inside. Tell me what happened. I was back in Ethiopia. The grunts, I, I lived it all again. What's happening to me? Shit. You know how your senses can trigger vivid memories? Make you think of sounds, sights, words from songs. Make you think of stuff you haven't thought of in years. The DNI can make that a lot more visceral. Little glitches on your optics, little whispers in your ear. The shit happens. Doctor can straighten it out. You just need to recalibrate your meds. Trust me, you're gonna be fine. So what now? Oh, right now? You're gonna interface with that console. As soon as you plug in, you'll be able to extract and process the information in a heartbeat. Got it. They had a man on the inside at Coalescence. He would have been able to supply them with everything they needed to bypass the security on the train. The botched assault, man, it took six hours for the ZSF to get that information. Outcome? Train go boom. Took you just six minutes. Yeah, it would have been five. If you hadn't freaked out when you saw those robots. But what happens now? Now we go find the son of a bitch. Tipped off by his terrorist pals. The mole was ready for him. 
in heavy duty combat grunts with them. Once again, Zerk security force got their asses handed to them. Outcome. Train go boom. We lost him. He slipped away. You remember Specialist Sarah Hall? She's gonna walk you through the next part. Trust her, do exactly what she says. I trained her myself. She's an intelligence expert from back when that actually meant something. Before DNI, you had to read books. In the Academy, Taylor made me read a lot of them. Well, some knowledge is worth earning. Appreciating. And that takes time. Time is something we don't always have. Okay, new blood. From this point on, the simulation deviates from actual events. Not that it's gonna feel any less real. Use your imagination. Sending his location to your HUD. Come on now, pick up the trail. Check your fire, civilians are not targeted. I still have line of sight. Our boy's hacking the ZSF talent. What does that tell you? He's running scared. Not sitting behind a computer. He could only be controlling them if he's got a DNI too. Here, smart one, new blood. I'll give you that. Son of a bitch is still moving. Use that billboard to get over the maglev train. Billboard to get over the maglev train. He's heading into Old Zurich. Move. All right, activating a new cyber ability. System paralysis. Remember your cyber abilities. Nice going, new blood. Nice going. Your cyber abilities don't come for free. They take a little time to recharge. Keep an eye on your HUD. We lose him, it's your ass, newbie. Nice job, new blood. Not so well, huh? I reckon our suspect has about 15 seconds left before he shakes hands with the Grim Reaper. You can't let that happen. Not before you get the information we need. I don't think he's in any condition to talk. He doesn't have to. He has a DNI.
Buried beneath layers of security protocols, a subject's DNI records cam footage of the user's past experiences. In extreme circumstances, it is possible to extract that information by force. You'll be able to push deep into the subject's memories, their thoughts, even their subconscious. You could learn everything we need to know about the terrorist plans. I'm sensing a butt coming up somewhere. You should know. Not only will this procedure be deeply traumatic for the subject, but the associated subconscious interference will leave him brain dead. Dead. Believe me, this is a bad way to go. He's a dead man anyway. Besides, he's a fucking terrorist. A few minutes ago, you knew nothing. What do you know now? I know where they are. They're using the old train tunnel to plan their attack. Hmm. What you just learned through your DNI took the ZSF weeks to uncover. What do you think I'm gonna say next? Outcome. Train go boom. It's good to know you can make tough decisions when you have to. I think it's time we moved on. ZSF finally tracked down the terrorists to this location. For their sake, they really wish they had. You're still here, huh? Pity. I bet D has a hundred that you'd be dead by now. Funny man, Specialist Peter Moretti. He's gonna help you understand how much of a badass motherfucker you are now. Remember, we still don't have the last piece of the puzzle. How in the hell they got the explosives on board the train? So we're clear? And this is over? You owe me a hundred. Back to business. As you know, one of the perks of being Black Ops is having access to the latest in experimental weaponry. Firearms may be your go-to choice for a weapon in a fight. But with DNI, your mind truly is your greatest weapon. Let's do some damage. Nice work. You immolated the shit out of him. Come on. 
They're using smoke grenades. Switching to your EV helps whenever you're blind, whether in the dark or in smoke. How about that? Now you never have to worry about what's lurking in the darkness. Not bad, new blood. Interface with that door for me.
What is this place? This. This is where it all went down. The computer over there should give us some insight into how they got the explosives on board. Go interface. They hacked the security robots. They brought the explosives on board. You want to hear something ironic? The reality was the terrorist attacks actually accelerated the development of the Winslow Accord Neural Network Initiative. If it wasn't for the fear of attacks like this one, we probably wouldn't even have the Cyber Soldier program. Hang in there. 725. Got about five minutes. You've been here before, New Blood. Let's see if you can change history. All robots should be considered hostile. Trust me, they'll consider you as much. Take down as another one of your cyber abilities. Try it out on those bots. Watch your flank. They're coming through the windows. Check your fire. No need to hit your sins unless we have
The whole thing's booby-trapped. If I hack it, try to move it, or detach the car, it's gonna blow. It's too much! Even with the computer in my head, there's not enough time! It's actually very simple. Wait. This is a maglev train. If I reverse the polarity on just this car... There was no way to stop it and get off the train. Your DNI might show you all the options, but only you can decide what you're willing to sacrifice. Sometimes, you have to let go. Taylor, how's our patient? As good as can be expected. I expect better. You should know that. Welcome back. You're being prepped for surgery now. It's gonna be okay. Hendrix wasn't even injured on the mission. He volunteered for this. The increasing prevalence of drones and combat robots has significantly reduced the reliance on human infantry. As I said before, we have no further comment to make at this time. We will continue to explore avenues of diplomatic negotiations. The WA have denied sending troops to the region, stating that they are still seeking a diplomatic solution to the standoff. We are coordinating closely with our allies in order to provide tactical support where needed. How long have we been doing this, Hendricks? Five years, give or take. Sounds about right. You ever think about where we're going next? Nope. You know me. I just go with the flow. <laughs>